<laughs> By a show of hands, how many of you have taken an antibiotic? Virtually everyone. Did you know that 65% of the antibiotics that we take are molecules that are found in nature? This isn't actually unique to antibiotics. 55% uh, of all the drugs we take are molecules that are at least inspired by molecules found in nature. I would argue that nature is our greatest chemist. And nature's not making these drugs to cure diseases in humans. They're making these drugs to gain a competitive advantage in the environment. For example, the antibiotics we use are almost all produced by soil microorganisms, organisms so small you can't see by the naked eye. There's about a billion tea, uh, microbes in a teaspoon of soil and about seven billion in the soil I put in this bottle. These organisms are competing for nutrients like food, sugar, and if you can make an antibiotic to kill your neighbor, you can steal your neighbor's food. <laughs> my, or, my lab works to try to figure out these kind of systems in the environment and leverage the molecules that are made in nature for the treatment of different diseases. An example of this is we collect millipedes in, uh, by Lane Stadium, and we're trying to leverage the molecules these millipedes make to defend themselves for the treatment of neurological disorders like the treatment of pain. And so I hope I've given you a little bit of a different outlook on the environment around you, including the soil in your backyard, as a true pharmacy that it could potentially be. Thank you. <laughs>